Hi, my name is Tyler Spajinski and I'm excited to introduce to you the Typhoon. The Typhoon is a DIY smartphone built with a Raspberry Pi, TFT with a touchscreen, 5 megapixel camera, and a serial controlled cellular module. The Typhoon uses the Raspberry Pi A+, giving it 700 megahertz of processing power and 256 megabytes of SD RAM. The Typhoon is powered by a 1200 milliamp hour lithium ion battery with one charge lasting approximately four hours. Let's turn it on and run through some of its basic features. The Typhoon runs a mobile OS called TyOS that I wrote myself in Python. It gives the Typhoon the ability to make and receive calls, send SMS text messages, and take photos. It also manages the battery level and the cellular connection. I'll open up the camera app. As you can see, I'm going to take a picture of a Raspberry Pi in a case. The camera app is based off a point and shoot camera project from Adafruit. So it's just running a modified version of their software. See, there's the picture. No. I'll exit the app and run or let's make a call. I'll call myself. I have the basic keypad. My phone's ringing, I wonder who this could be. Hello? Who is this? Hello? Hello? You must have the wrong number. As you can tell, there's a little echo and a delay when I'm talking to myself, but Otherwise, it works just like a normal phone. The speaker is right here, and the microphone is right here, so you can just hold it backwards. Now, I just open up the text messaging app. Let's see if you can see it. On the top bar, I just put in the number. I want to send a text message to. And type your message. Oh, Hmm, got text message. That's basically it. Open up the apps menu and hit the power button. Everything freezes up because the uh, Raspberry Pi and the phone module is getting powered down. And once, every, once the small dash stops blinking, just flip the power switch. Everything powers down. 
Thank you for watching.